So hi there, my name's Colin Shave and I'm from the Salon app and I just wanted to share a quick playbook with you about how you can really benefit from gift cards. So the whole story behind gift cards, you know, often we think, well, you know, are they actually worth the trouble? They can be something that gets stuck under the reception desk or they're left in a in a you know in in a drawer and we we sell the odd one now and again, but that that's really about it. Well, anyway, I wanted to share a case study with you. Um, one of our customers, a lady called Romy Birdwhistle, she owns a hair and beauty salon in Ireland called Paradise Hair and Beauty. And a while back, she ran a campaign which just achieved some astonishing results. And it really kind of reframed the way that you can use gift cards to your advantage. So the campaign was really simple. She messaged her active clients. So she took any client that had, had a booking within the last six months or so and she sent them this message and it was simply hi client first name so hi mary buy a 100 pound paradise gift card and get the second 100 pound for 50 pound um you know to take advantage of the offer call the salon telephone number now the offer is valid for 48 hours or while stocks last so what she did there is she identified clients that are likely to respond they know who she is so they're active clients and she personalized it so it felt like someone was receiving an invitation as opposed to a generic center wall type campaign um, she gave the irresistible offer a real sort of hook you know so get a second gift card for 50 pounds so half price on the second gift card and actually what she's really doing is she's doing a 25 percent discount um, but it just sounds and feels so much better and the next thing she did is she gave her clients a call to action and she made it time sensitive and added an element of scarcity to it so let's have a look at what happened so the results for that came campaign were quite extraordinary she generated over six thousand euros within 48 hours so, I mean, that's just the most astonishing outcome from a short term campaign to put some perspective around that. An average salon in the UK would not sell six thousand pounds worth of vouchers or gift cards in a year. So to do it in 48 hours is really quite extraordinary. It, uh, and of course, then there were additional benefits to this as well, because many of those gift cards were sold as presents. They were bought for other people. And in the following three months, Paradise actually looked after 362 new clients, which was 30% more than they would normally get over that period. It, uh, and apart from an amazing campaign, you know, gift cards are a real value add to your clients. So one of the really nice things about them is that you can benefit by maintaining a high average bill you know my, my wife's looking for a gift card for her birthday from from a beauty salon that she goes to and she wants a, a facial so I walk in and I say well how much is a is a facial and they give me a list of 15 facials so I I buy a gift card which covers the most expensive one you know and and, and that's not unique behavior so top typically what would happen is you know someone will come in with a gift card which is has more credit or balance on it than the price of the service they're booked for which of course makes a second subsequent visit far more likely than it would be otherwise um you know it increases new clients so as we saw at paradise you know a lot of these gift cards are actually then gifted or or, or given away as presents and it's positive cash flow which is quite unique in the salon business you know we spend so much time swapping time for money and this is one of those instances where we just take the money and then there is draw down on the time over time so it's a you know it's a it's a real positive cash flow without having to necessarily have the resource to be able to service it in the immediate term and it's great pr i know we've all been asked to uh contribute to like a local charity or you know uh, a, a raffle or a charitable night or a homeless shelter or whatever it, whatever it might be and it's so much nicer for the person that's winning it to actually receive a voucher which is you know or a gift card which is beautifully packaged up and it feels like something that you want to take home as opposed to see if anyone else wants the table around the table wants to wants to take it home instead and you can optimize your gift up gift card performance really easily so i mean the first thing uh, i would say is get them professionally branded ensure that they absolutely look and feel how you would want something to look and feel you want clients to feel this is worth worth having and then present them 
appropriately and by that i mean don't just give someone a gift card or a gift voucher as a piece of paper you know with an envelope if you put them in an envelope put the envelope in an envelope in a little box and if you've got a little box put a bow on a little box and then put the box with the bow in a in a, in a, in a nice bag and put some tissue paper in it make it something worth having you know take take inspiration from people like tiffany's and selfridges you know people that really do this sort of stuff well a little bit of attention to detail can make all the difference it's a and then display them around the salon so that your clients know that they're available so even if your team are not as proactive as you want them to be in selling them or recommending people take them uh clients will see them like to look at them and ask if they can buy them so again it's just a, a, a an absolute win-win at different times of the year i mean typically uh christmas black friday valentine's etc um you, you know add a little sentence on the end of your appointment reminders just to say you know p.s we've got gift cards available um when you come in when you come in the salon and you know appointment cards and price lists and etc you know make sure that you've got space set aside to tell people that the gift cards are available and last but not least obviously your website get a page on there where you can tell people that uh, that, that gift cards are available and post on your social media as well anyway that's that so the, the the key things that we covered there is don't just um, leave them in a drawer and wait for people to ask display them around the salon make them something worth buying, something worth having. And also don't be afraid of trying some of these amazing campaigns that you can run to really use them to generate cash flow in the short term whenever you need it. Anyway, thanks for watching.